The first race at Hollywood Bet Scottsville has gone the way of Epic View, the Red Row filly for Ben Saad and Sterling Miller. Tristan Godden's done the duty from behind the main, and uh, Waterford Stud are the breeders. And Richard, pardon me, Robert rather, Robert is with me, and he gets a thousand rand. Well done, Robert. On behalf of our sponsors, a thousand rand your way. Well done. Thank you very much. Where is Tristan? Come through, Tristan. When you first open the race card and you have a look and uh, this uh, horse's uh, debut performance five lengths off but you know you arrive at the races you see the money well, you don't but i'm talking about the the racing uh, people see the, the the money for other horses etc um makes it difficult to predict but five lengths off wasn't a bad run yes no in hindsight it wasn't a bad run she was obviously very green first time out um her work at home she's been showing us good work at home and she only got beat five lengths and uh, Tandy did say she would uh, prefer a bit further. So today, step up in trip 1200. Obviously, it was a competitive uh, race. You know, a few of the race runners and a few of the unraced, they also fancied. Um, but uh, once she got going, uh, she won a good race. She certainly did. Now, um, you've got a few rides still to come. What are you expecting? I know you said the other day that you were happy to have a winner for Mr. Rich or to, you know, it was a bit of a drought that you were going through, but uh, the drought is gone now, thank goodness. Yeah, let's, uh, let's hope. Uh, just a big thanks to Mr. and Mrs. Miller and to Mr. Yudi, uh, to Sterling. You know, they've been uh, giving me a lot of support. Um, every, every week I'm getting rides for them, so I really appreciate it. Uh, well done to Mr. Saad as well. I think it's my first winner for you. Uh, Serena and the whole team as well. And then to my sponsor, Sporting Post. Yeah, well done. Thanks. Okay, Sporting Post are the sponsors and we wish Lance Benson a speedy recovery as he'll be watching this, no doubt, from his hospital bed. Craig, uh, well done, and uh, nothing like one run to bring them on. Yes, you know, she, she, her first run, we thought she'd be right there. We actually thought she'd win on her work. Uh, and she was just very green on the outside and just uh, never reproduced what she'd shown at home. And uh, she works well again during, uh, since her last run, and this is what she can do. The rest of your uh, card, you, you're always happy to share the information and, and your thoughts with the viewers, and uh, you've got a couple still to come. Yes, we've got a couple uh, for Mr. Sardin, well done to, to Ben and Lida and Sterling for this fitty, and to Mike and Ray, as we always say, but she's not going to stop here. She's certainly better than uh, a one-time winner. And, you know, we've got a couple more. We've got um, Only Hearts in the next, uh, ran on nicely, so if she says the 16 well, she'll be right there. The other two fiddies, uh, we're hoping for improvement in the third. And then, obviously, um, October Song ran a better race last time, back down the straight with no blinkers on. And uh, Palm Breeze over the 12 last time ran a very good race. She just said if she actually hadn't looked around so much, she'd been right, right there, if not winning it. So we put the blinkers back on her. If the thousand are just a little short, she'll be on right on top of them, if not in front. Thank you for your feedback. It's most appreciated. And long may the hits keep coming for the team. Thank you very much. Lovely. That's Craig Udy, uh, who's the able assistant to uh, Mike Miller. Well done to everybody concerned. Ben and your family, the Saad family, well done. Lovely to see these bright orange colours in the winner's box, especially here in KwaZulu-Natal. And that is a wrap then for the first race, preparation for race two.